Hi everyone. So as you may know, after every set of a game that I play, especially if it's the first set, I go onto a wiki page designed for that game, and I figure out what I've missed or what what I've um, you know what, what I've done and what the enemies are called and whatnot, so that I know what to put for keywords on YouTube and to see whether there's something I need to do better or there's something I've done wrong and I can redo it. Just to make things a little bit easier, that's all. And there's something I noticed for Croc. When I went onto the wiki page, it told me that there are bonus worlds in every... well, in, in some levels. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just quickly go to the ones that I've missed in the first... well, in, in the levels that I've already done. So, the first one is in the very first world that we went to, so I'm just going to load into here, and it's right at the very beginning, so I don't really need to do any editing. Right. So, as you know, we've already done all of this, so I'm just going to ignore that, pretty much. The first one is on here, apparently. One, two, three. There we go. So we stomp on this platform three times and it should teleport us here. Okay, I don't really know what this is all about. Oh, okay, so that's that's a life. That's useful. Another life. And we guess another life. Wow. Pretty good. So there we go, three lives and 12 crystals. And I assume that's death in the middle, so I won't go and touch that. So this is basically all it is. It's just a, a way of getting a few extra things if you need them. And uh, in order to get back, we touch the sparkly thing. Just like that. Now this should take us... yeah, this takes us back to the beginning. So, obviously it's very useful, say if you're uh, not very good at the game, for example. Now, I don't know what happens if you quit. Do you save the lives that you've collected? Uh, quit, quit level. There we go. So, 15 lives. Do I still have those lives? How do I find out? I don't really know unless I go into the next level. So let's go into the next one, which is 1-3. Now this is kind of in the middle, I think. You know, it says it says it's at the start. I've written these down, you see, so I know where I'm going. Ah, yes, yeah, so we do keep the lives. That's very useful. So let's go in over here. The next one is here. Ah, here we are. There's a little sparkly thing. So let's see where this takes us. Oh, interesting. Now there's something else I figured out, uh, well I say figured out, there's something else I noticed. When I was looking around for things I've missed, I came across a glitch. And it's one used in speedruns, because it helps you get across gaps. Oh no, it's not, not that. Like that. It's a hovering technique. Now it doesn't last for very long but it can be quite useful. So, I don't think I'll be using it much. If there's a gap that I guess I could evade, I suppose it could be quite useful. Oh, come on now. Yeah, fine. But whatever, here we are. That's... That's the first two I was going to show you. There is one more, which is in the uh, the boss level. Which apparently gives us a lot more than any of the others. So there we go, we've got 17 lives now, which is quite useful. Let's quit the level. And the final one is in here. Lair of the Feeble. Now this one is... I think it's a little bit further. So let's just skip that. 
Oh no, it's it looks like it's still in the first part of the level, so hopefully it shouldn't take us too long to get there. What we need to do... Wish this moved a bit quicker. I'll tell you what, I'll, um, I'll just edit this out, and when I get there, I'll, uh, I'll show you where it is. Oh, I'm very sorry, I've, um, I've actually misinterpreted what I've written down. This isn't in the first boss, it's in the second boss, so never mind. But um, I hope this was useful. Oops, that was a very silly thing to do. Okay, well thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this little bit of information. Oh, let's see if I can do this. No, I can't. <laughs> Oh, come on. I've gotten a bunch of lives, so I'm going to see if I can try and get it. Okay, it works there. No. Never mind. Like I said, thank you very much for watching. I hope it's uh, been insightful, so you know where these little bits of bonus areas are. Just for the uh, the places I've already visited. It's only in 1 and 3 so far, because I haven't got anything past the first secret level. So, join me again for set 2. We'll be going to the Tumbling Dantini. <laughs>